the next speaker on my list is UN Watch. Thank you, Madam President. UN Watch welcomes the delegation of the former Yugoslav Republic of Macedonia and the report before us today. The country is a member of the Human Rights Council and as such has constructively cooperated with its mechanisms and has supported a number of important initiatives and resolutions to promote and protect human rights around the world. We are encouraged by the government's commitment to implement the vast majority of the UPR recommendations. We also note that most of the accepted recommendations are currently being implemented. These include combating discrimination, trafficking and domestic violence, further strengthening judicial independence and protecting children's rights. We hope that more measures can be taken to further enhance civil and political rights for all and protect the rights of all persons, regardless of one's sexual orientation and gender identity. During the discussion with the Special Rapporteur on Freedom of Opinion and Expression, the government reiterated its commitment for the protection of this right. Several measures have been adopted since the visit by the Special Rapporteur in implementation of the recommendations containing his report. We urge the government to take further actions to ensure freedom of the media with a view to promote the right to access information, safeguard the independence of the media, and ensure respect for diversity and non-discrimination. We wish the government of the former Yugoslav Republic of Macedonia great success in implementing the UPR recommendations. Thank you.